Can I destroy this? Nope. Okay. Wow. Mm, up here? I feel like there's gonna be something up there. Possibly? Nope. Okay. Wow. This is the perfect shelf for just rolling around. Oh, okay, everything just loaded in. <laughs> Who's this guy? Very sweet. Kill him. Oh. Anything underneath? Now, why would you not put something underneath the bridge? Come on now. Game designers do better. <laughs> is this? Like, where do you even find that metal gray? Oh, okay. Curtains. Film. Some cats. Probably the developer's cats. Let's see, a fresh face in town, and right before the trash day, too. Which trash day? Oh, he doesn't know. He doesn't know what the trash day is. I couldn't spoil the surprise for you now. You'll know soon enough. And that is a long, complex history of Selectite's trade route with New Carcinia. Wow, I'm so glad I stuck around to learn all that lore. Thanks, Uncle Adi. And the oh. Okay. It's over here. Oh. Welcome to New Carcinia, a beacon of civilization amongst the harsh violence of the sands between. A testament to the prevailing power of industry, the city of dreams, the big crab apple, and the defining pillar of the trash economy which supports all of crustacean society. How do I get into this conversation? My name, you ask? Tortellini, the town greeter. Tortellini? At your service. I'm beyond excited to greet two new visitors in a single day. Is that a lot? Not at all. We usually get 20 or 30. Then why... Wait, did you say two? Was the other one a shark carrying the coolest shell you've ever seen? Oh, a friend of yours? Not at all. I've got to kick that guy's butt and get my shell back. Oh, oh a smart enemy then. This day gets more exciting by the minute. I've got to catch him before he sells my shell to who knows who. Can you tell me where he went? Not at all. I greeted him with gusto and then didn't give him a second thought. What sort of town greeter would I be if I looked behind me to keep tabs on those I've already greeted rather than facing forward to greet those yet to come? Okay, okay, okay. Where should someone tr trying to sell a shell go? I can think of exactly four places. I might have tried to sell it to Shellfish Desires, the luxury goods store. If it's more of an antique shell, they may have gone to check if the museum curator might purchase it. Failing those, they might have visited Bottom Feeders, a dive bar in the lower crest to try to pass it off to some piece of gutter trash. And finally, they could have gone to the back alley blacksmith to sell it for scrap. Okay, thank you so much. I'll check out all those places. Caught speed, small fry. Would that, I, would that I could give you more of a tour. But my work is never done unless there remain travelers left ungreeted. Kill him. Dang it. There's a whole city underneath and on top. God dang, dude. I've just been unable to stop thinking about those awful businesses happening in the grove. Would you hush up and enjoy your kelp, Benedict? All this bleeding heart nonsense is ruining brunch. You see that hermit over there? Isn't he so mysterious? The one standing uncomfortably close to us right now? Heavens no, not them. The mysterious blue one over by the bar. Oh, please, tell me you don't mean Firth. Tilapia went on a date with him and he tried to get her to invest in sand dollars. You deserve someone better. Delty. Some hard-working crab who... Who will treat you right. But he's just so mysterious. Mysterious. <laughs> oh, hey there. Long time no see, fellow hustler. You're that guy from the bridge. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Sure am. Firth's the name. Don't erode it, you know? You seem pretty happy. Didn't you just lose all your money? Ah, ha, ha. Ah, of course not, pal. Not even close. A shrewd investor never puts all his shells in one. I mean, puts all his butts in one shell, you know? And that's my goal in life. I get butts into shells. Specifically my butt. And specifically the fanciest, flashiest, most impressive shell I can possibly can. You feel me? Not really. I'm a shell trader, kid. 
That are, that's a hermit lot. That's a hermit's lot in life. Always looking to upgrade. Swap out the old shell for a better one. If you're smart, you'll get into the business too. Whole ocean of opportunity could be passing you by, you know? What do you say? You ready to start your journey up the property ladder? Could get you in a flashy new shell by ties in, you know? Think about it then. You're lost, kid. Can I get in? No. I think I gotta go to those four places, so. Let's see if I can. Uh, if they don't have a drawing, then they're not important, so I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna give them a voice. But wait, before we continue, this video was sponsored by me. Yeah, so I run an Etsy as an Etsy account. I have a bunch of 3D prints and it's called JK 3D Productions. I do 3D art and I figured I can make 3D prints out of it. So if we make a lot of gaming related stuff, a lot of RuneScape stuff, some other stuff, and it's all inspired. And if you're interested, we also do commissions. So if there's anything you'd like, you'd like to have printed out, we could always print it out and make it for you and get it sold. And yeah, and if you're interested, just check out our shop, JK3D Productions, on Etsy. Thanks, and back to the show. Oh, they really aren't even important enough to have a line. <laughs> Point. God. That sound is so freaking loud. You're not going to hear it because I properly leveled my audio. You're welcome. Is this a CVS receipt? Oh, sorry. It's a C&D receipt. <laughs> C&D's nuts. <laughs> Clever. Excuse me. What is this building? Well, hello, little one. You stand before the new Carcinian Museum of Carcinized History, I say. Oh, neat. Can I go in? Apologies, but the museum is currently closed to the public while we put the finishing touches on the new exhibition. Oh. Hey, I'm looking for a tall shark who stole my shell. You seen one like that? Hmm, can't say I have. But if I'd travel here to fence stolen goods, I'd start in the lower crust down beneath us. Gotcha. Thanks. Careful down there, I say. Hey, can I go out this way? No! Okay, I'll go somewhere else. Sorry, sorry, I didn't mean to snap at you like that. I'm just under a lot of pressure, okay? People are not happy that they, can go, they can't get to the open ocean right now. They keep calling me names like phoned in progress blocker and saying my fence is lazy design. There's a good reason for that. Trash Island is on its way here right now. If we kept all the avenues of transit open during trash day, it'd be a cod dang slip show in here. Ship show. Why can't all these civvies understand that the rules are there for a reason? Yeah. Come on. Alright, whatever. <laughs> oh. Oh. This new shell? No. Welcome to Shellfish Desires, the flagship brick and mortar store of Shellfish Corp. How goes it, my visibly financially troubled friend? Is it that obvious? It is. I suppose you've come up to the upper crust for a bit of window shopping. No shame in it. Plenty of folks pause on their way through town to take a look at our luxury shelves. You got five minutes before your pause becomes a loiter, so enjoy them all stay the blast, my friend. Have you seen my show? Did Rick Shark come in? Oh, he sure did. Told me to get stuff. We don't do trade-ins here. And if we did, I'd never take the kind of beat-up junk he sold me. Not a clue where he went after that. Is nobody in this city paying attention? Buy shelves. Is that a pasta? Flaccid and rubbery as soon as it entered the water. What's the point? Hey, yo! Consume some shell health to restore quill self. You eat edible shell. Twists the currents around you to spin at high velocity, damaging any. Imposter. Your mommy becomes a dense cloud of ink that causes enemies to lose track of you.
Rainbow Crabitalism. Blackout Poncho. Ivory Poncho. Mr. Krabs. Cold Eater. Man, who the freak has this much money just going laying around? Oh god. As shellfish desires, you can pay microplastics to ensure your sh any shell you won before. At a moon snail shell, you can pick any uninsured shell to start with. Any insured shell to start with every time you respawn. Useful. There's shell insurance. I want to buy shell insurance. Don't scam me. Played RuneScape. You can't scam me. Who's this loser? Loser. Just what I thought. Okay, I think I've talked to everyone up here, so let's start going down. I don't even know where to start. Look at these guys. Jackson up there, probably. Is this a sponge? Oh my god. <laughs> the end is nigh. The gunk. Yes, indeed. <laughs> We'll see, and you'll all see. What's this? Chip claw. 500 microplastics. That sounds pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. Man, I am so bad at it landing on, like. Oh my gosh. Okay. Come on. Just, just let me land. There we go. Uh, okay. Oh, well, I mean, I kind of want to go down, so that was kind of pointless. But, oh, who's this guy? Oh, oh, okay. Top spiders. They'll make you feel special or useful, but don't be fooled. Oh, top ciders. Don't trust those top ciders. Them darn rich folk. Nobody likes them. Anything else? Super S. I always thought it was the S from Charmed. Okay, hey, editing jig up here. Okay, so I do feel like I need to uh, make myself a little bit more clear here because essentially what I was thinking of was there is this old show called Charmed, right? And uh, is in that show they had a book where like the three main witches or whatever would go over to it and kind of like examine it and learn a new spell or something or. I don't know, some Monster of the Week stuff. Anyways, and uh, I swear, for some reason, I remember their, that Super S being the cover of the book. Like, I, I don't remember this. I remember it being a Super S on the front of the book. I don't know if I'm having some kind of, like, Mandela effect or something, but something's going on with it. I swear to God, I remember seeing that Super S in Charm. So I always associated that S with the Charmed S. <laughs> Anyways, back to the show. <laughs> Everyone calls it a super S, so I guess that's the name that's stuck. What? Come on now. Really? If I got a bit head start. Nope, okay. Guess I can't go up there. Design, yo. 984208. Item. 
princess. Bread claw. Nothing there. What's this? Okay. Useless. This guy seems cool. Did I hear a car? What the freak? A lot of nothing going on in, in these conversations. Yeah, nothing much happens here, so let's go ahead and just fast forward through all this, and then I'll probably fast forward through the rest of the town too. Well, I broke our cool crystal. No way. Just walked right up and broke it. What happened to live and let live, Coley? No idea. Life really wasn't what it used to be. Want to go find another cool crystal? I sure do. Can't let tricks like that ruin our chill. So true. Is that? Oh my god, it's Andre. Where are you off to? Holy there, Scrap. It's a fine piece of metal of metal in your claws right there. This I promise. Care to make a shine with me, Scrap? We see my shell. Did a big jerk come here trying to sell a shell for Scrap? It would have probably seemed crazy to you because the shell was super gorgeous and cool. Aye, he came by. Turned that shell to Scrap as soon as I could. What? Are you serious? Sure, I see if I'm him. No, wait. You say a shark? Scrap that, my mistake. No sharks came by, nay. What? What do you think I said? You almost gave me a heart attack. No need a shot. Scrap. My ears work just fine. I guess Shen? Are you mean my fork? This is some piece of junk I found in my neighborhood. Yeah, yeah what a piece of junk it is, Scrap. And you'll smith some relics, he can break it down. And he'll show you what that junk of yours can truly do. Sounds useful. Upgrade. Level 2, plus 5 attack. Upgrade again. No. Oh. Okay, that's cool. Nice little Andre. Fine. Hey there, youngin. Welcome to Bottom Feeders. Find us a little water hole this side of the slurry. Hi, my name's Krill. New to town, I guess. Thought I recognize the fresh face. Please, it's plastic to meet you, Krill. Name's Nimba. If you've got the money, why not stop in and stop on in for a bite? My kiddos and I would love to have you. We also offer a stowaway hiring service if you're interested in such a thing. I know what a stowaway is. I'm sure you've seen one around. That's our nickname for some sort of little fella that sticks to your shell, little fella. Oh, like a barnacle? Exactly. And for the right price, there's all sorts of them that might tag along. People pay for that? They sure do, hun. Lots of our readers here are travelers just stopping by who could use a little company on the road. You ought to consider it if you've got a journey ahead of you. The open ocean can get mighty lonely, hun. Now think about it, thanks, ma'am. Oh, call me Nemo, hun. I'm not a crabby old lady just yet. Cute. You see my shell? Fairly sure I'd move a fellow like that someone in my establishment. Sorry, kiddo. That's okay. No worries, Nenema. Ooh, increased stowaway capacity. Oh, I don't have enough. A razor blade. Oh. A lug nut. Packing peanut. Lamprey. Plus 3% health drain. 28 attack, Jesus Christ. Oh, another crap. <laughs> Tax deal, 20% balance damage. 30% shell spell damage. Increases microplastic rewards. <laughs> okay. Uh, can I, oh. It's gotta be somewhere. I just gotta find where that shark went. I'm gonna get hit by a car. Car's gonna hit me. Car's gonna hit me. Oh, okay. This city is so big, how am I ever going to find my shell? This place is so stupid. It's loud. How can everyone just leave me alone? 
Everywhere I turn, someone's trying to take something away from me. Or somebody's looking to scuttle right up, fellow citizens. It's a grand opening of the prawn shop, full of legitimate shallows made wares. We got plastics, we got metals, we got packing foam, we got garbage you ain't even heard of yet. What the? My shell! I'm gonna kill you. Th that's my shell. Are you serious? This guy's still following me? Alright, play cool. I don't know what you're talking about. Give that back. It was stolen from me by a jerk shark. First off, that shark seems super cool and chill to me. Second of all, he uh, sold it to me fair and square. You want it back, you gotta buy it like everything else in the store. That's how the pound shop works, baby. How much? What can I actually pay it with? Depends what you got, pal. I got a few microplastics, I guess, and some string. The shell's really important to me. Could I work for it or something? I'll do anything. Anything, huh? Yeah, I guess I could probably come up with some arduous and meanless time sinks for you to partake in and earn your shell back. For starters, why don't you scrape the barnacles off my sweaty- Wait, wait, did you hear that? Hear what? Belay this conversation, kid. Trash Island is here. It's always catching me off guard. I gotta get ready before I miss out on some prime plastics. Hey, I'm not done talking to you. Missing a sound effect there. Crunch. What is that thing? I've never seen anything like it. It's a message from the captain. It's got his face right on it. It's gotta be. Excuse me. Excuse me, please. Pardon me. Excuse me, young lady. As new Cassinia's official historian, I'm sure I can shed some light on. My God! If I'm not mistaken, this is. Part of a map. map! A map showing the way to a most valuable treasure, I say. If someone were to find its missing pieces and decipher them, why, they'd be rich beyond their wildest dreams, I say. That's me. Rich? I like the sound of that. That treasure's as good as mine. Oh, I gave I'll him the wrong to voice. I'll be able the shell in the ocean, you know? Not if I get there first. Think of all the tourists that treasure can bring to our city. Well, don't you count out us, bottom siders. Hey, I was You'll right. be eating your hat when I get that treasure and fix up my restaurant. It would appear the hunt is on, I say. The first stop on the map seems to be the forest to the north of here. May the best, crab. What? What? Apologies for the interruption, folks. I seem to have misheard something. I could have almost sworn there were some citizens here planning on unearthing some valuables. Who's this Need punk? I remind you all how threatening the ocean is outside this reef? I'd hope it would go without saying that the duty of such a dangerous excavation would fall to the Shellfish Corporation. That would be safest for all involved. Don't you agree? Yeah, we, we hear you, Roland. No, no problem. Then, as Shellfish Corp CEO in this fair city's de facto mayor, I suppose no one would have any objections to my taking sole control of this treasure hunt. Are we all in agreement? Oh, oh dear. I, I suppose that sounds all right with me, I say. You hear what they're talking about over there? Sounds like some kind of crazy treasure hunt. Hey kid, I just got an idea. If you can go get that treasure there, John, about, I'll gladly trade your shell for it. For, for real? You'd really do that? You bet. A prawn never goes back on his promise. Aw, yeah! I'm gonna find that treasure! Haha, <laughs> 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 yeah, you go, kid. Roland can't tell us what to do. That treasure belongs to whoever can find it first! The corporations don't control us! I suppose a little friendly competition is only fair. I hope you know what you just dove into, kid. See you in the open ocean, treasure hunters. These <laughs> were in silica gel. <laughs> Was it dress? 
Start the treasure hunt. Dang, that was crazy with the capital Z. Really stepped in now, kid. The squid, that squid that hangs around Roland doesn't think twice about disappearing people. He told me to. Hey, I can recall merely making an assumption, pal. Making a suggestion. But the offer still stands. If you can give me that treasure, the shell's all yours. Okay, well, where do I start? Won't you listen to that old dude? It's off in the grove, way north of here. You got a bit of a walk ahead of you. Great. Well, I guess I have no choice now. I'm on the treasure hunt, whether I like it or not. Oh, yeah, one more thing. If you find any other junk out there, I'll take it off your hands for some microplastics. Fair is fair. Sell junk. Sell all. Sell all. Sell all. Sell all. Buy junk. 5,000 for a relic. God dang. Shark egg. This feels kind of unethical. Home. 999,999,999. Wow. I see how it is. Real and bad guys with the little spear there. Oh, do I use barbed hooks whenever I like reel stuff in? Oh my god, there's so many people to talk to. 